to dread. <laughs> yeah. See you guys again. <laughs> Very good, guys. Ooh, gotta see that. So tomorrow I'm gonna try and go old school. The weather's looking quite good in Westbrook. Um, so I'm gonna go start off looking for some snook. Then I'm gonna go out, pull some rapalas a little bit quickly, get some live bait. And then uh, hang in the cooter line. If nothing's happening on the cooter side, I'm gonna do a little bit of uh, vertical jigging uh, while my live bait hang out the back and see what happens. See you in the water. Okay, I got myself into a little bit of a, a pickle here. Hooked a nice early morning snook, but <laughs> he's on this this line here. This rapala has been hooked up badly. Ow! <clears throat> I've just dropped my rod in the reel. My, ah. This is not a good situation. But let's see what we can do. This is an actual total mess up here. Yeah, this is a proper mess up. Okay. Am I weird? If I get this undone with a snook on. <sighs> the problem is this thing keeps pulling. There we go, I think I've got it. Thank freaking goodness, that was a bug wrap of nuts. Good timing. Sheesh, what a nightmare. What a freaking nightmare. Now I can get this guy in. Let's get the gaff ready. My gaff is right at the top of my ski. As usual, it would be even more complicated. Let me just make sure my drag's loose here because I'm going to stick my hand right in my ski here. There we go. <laughs> that was the luck. <laughs> I let my leg drag loose. <laughs> okay. Now we can fight properly. We are all set. So on fillet side, have heard that the uh, snook have been favouring fillets, so we went with the fillet setup. I'm not a super fan of I hate fillet tech rapala, it's much easier fishing for with rapalas. But if they're biting them, why not? That was a total, total disaster. But at least we got out of that one. I was hoping for a snook this morning, so should make a nice little run when you get to the boat. Okay, loose, always loosen drag when you get close to the boat. There he is. Nice little snook. Yeah, usual case, when they get close to the boat, they usually do a nice little run. Nice size snook, not, not huge, not, not tiny, sort of mid-range, looks like about a five kilo odd boy. But yeah, these things are mostly meat, which is nice. So even a small fish got a lot of meat on it. Here we go, nice looking fish. Nice and healthy. Oh. <laughs> Funny as I dropped my gaff. It was slimy. 
Does not want to come near my ski, this guy. He is not keen. Don't blame him. <laughs> Don't blame him. Oh, almost a gap shot there. Mm, my gaff is blunt. <laughs> Didn't even go through him. Nice shot to the head, but... Oh my word, I'm literally the world's worst gaffer. Got him. Yes, what a mission. Gaff trick works every time. This is a little thingy. It's all mirror. So forgive me guys, I don't know how this works. If this is does work, uh, Grand Slam, Sean Reed for the um, Schlotti Kayak Fishing Club Kingy release other. Um, I think this is how it works, 2024. how wild this finder is just full 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 up i think it's little kingies and stuff so i've dropped my my little spoon down and uh, i'm gonna drop them down to the bottom should get a pull of some sort but it's just absolutely full up so it's a little sprat spoon um very small sprat spoon so yeah if these, if these fish are chying I'll, i should hook it Let's see if I can get something here. But look at that finder, all the way up to like 10 meters, just full, 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 full. Okay, on the bottom, so let's go. There we go. <laughs> okay, so we'll see what it is now. <laughs> you would get one eventually. Oh, it's a little bonito. No, a little scad. Okay. There we go, torpedo scad. <laughs> There's plenty of these eggs around. Chill, 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 bro. Chill. Okay, little torpedo scad there. <laughs> Lots of fun. Oh, they're all underneath the boat now. They're all underneath now. Let's get another one. What a jaw. It snuck early this morning and now just jawling around. Yeah, there's some bigger fish here as well on the surface. Yeah, that's very interesting. Looks like there's some cooter here. Oh no, there's some good fish here alongside this shoal, whatever the shoal is here. What a beautiful morning. Absolutely cracker morning. Just absolutely smoke line. So you guys will get to see this. Uh, I'll edit this. But wow, what a run. Whatever's on here is a, is a good fish. As I came over the stud, this guy just screamed. Hope you guys heard that. Look, that was mental. <laughs> Sorry, you guys can't see the fight now nicely, but hope you guys heard that. Yes. My word. What a run. That guy ran like, that was about almost a 200 meter. He peeled off about 200 meters worth of line. So, 
Turpin, heck. What a pull. Got my drag quite tight as well. This is my down rigged live bait. Um, so, whew. I really do hope this is a good fish. Pull duck, yo. Yo, oh, that's a, that feels like a cooter. I feel like we're on with a good cooter here. I've been seeing them under the finder all day today, but they just haven't been eating. And uh, yeah, now we are on to one. Wow. <laughs> pulled so hard, you actually pulled the sinker off, which is good. This just costs a bit of money. But we'll see it's fighting on the surface, so definitely must be a cooter. Just gonna loosen drag now because as we get close, you gotta loosen your drag a bit. Listen to that. <laughs> yeah. There you go, guys, again. <laughs> Very good, guys. You gotta see that. Let you guys have a look at that drills just peeling off. How epic. Well, I started that live very at the, at the right time there, guys. <laughs> I started it as, as we hooked a flipping beast of a... There you guys again. Yo. So that's just a spool. I don't even have like the ratchet on. So you must know this guy's going. I really hope this is a good size cooter. I've been wanting one all year, just haven't had any luck to get a good size cooter yet. I'll show you guys once I've landed them and hopefully landed them and hatched them. Then I'll uh, I'll turn the camera around and you guys can have a look at it. Hopefully it's a big one, but the whole fight will be on my GoPro later. So you'll be able to check, check that out on the GoPro. Sometimes these cooter just give some these big cooter give like a couple big runs and then they actually get lactic acid in their build up so quickly and then they actually die. So yeah. You can sometimes have a couple big runs and then and then it's pretty easy to get the fish into the hatch after that. So I just want to move my my paddle to the other side. They're just hoping there's no sharks around. But yeah, so lacquer. It was so lacquer when the fish pulls like that. <laughs> it's a rock hard. <laughs> yeah, I wish. <laughs> no, I don't wish actually. I don't wish. Let's see now. Okay, we're getting some nice line on it now. I should get a, a check a look at it just now. Not too long from now. If he's under control next to the boat, I'll I'll let you guys. No, nah, actually, let me not be silly. I'll I'll rather land him, and then I'll let you guys have a look. A bit nervous. Jeez, this guy pulled down. My word. Okay, it's up on the surface now. Oh, weird. Shows you how hectically you ran. Okay, should be coming close. Should be getting a view of them soon. You can see my leader line. Not the fish yet. Come on, let me have a look. Let me have a look. I want to see it. I haven't seen it yet. Oh wow guys. <laughs> it's a beaut. Wow. Yeah, it's a good fish here. Yeah. It is a good fish. 
Oh wow, this is a log boys and girls. This is an absolute log. What a beaut. Wow. Mm, mm, mm. Mm. Very nice. Oh, you can just hear the chunkiness of that tail. Got to get my gaff out. Wow. Love big cuter like this. Sure. Okay, let me just get my gaff, guys. It's right here. Oh my word, oh my word, I really hope I land this, I really do, here he is, here he comes, <laughs> sorry about all the laughing and giggling, it is, Gaffed him nicely in the head. So I just need to <clears throat> move my right to the back. Okay, I'm gonna miss you guys for a sec. While I get him in, I'm just gonna move it. This. Oh wow! <laughs> oh wow! Whew. Wow! This is what we were looking for. Oh yes! I'll show you guys now. Sorry, don't. Sorry about that view. Let me flick it around. Whew. Here's the result of a cracker morning. You can see the size of this boy. Huge. Living up here at Westbrook. So doing the basics and uh, fishing old school. <laughs> <laughs> 